So Gio, and I am part of the uh, FreeTax server team. And today with me today is GDA from Orion Lab. Hi, Greg. How are you doing? Hi. So today we want to present to you our concept for a extended situational awareness going from level one of situational awareness that today tax server is implementing, that is perception to comprehension and projection in which we are able to forecast and report future state of an event and understanding the meaning and situation of the current situation. So and we are going to a, a interesting deployment and technology in action today. So Greg here will represent a special force operator and he's not using ATAC, he's using the Orion client that is a push to talk Android application, also available on the iOS. And that client connects to a uh, voice server called Orion server. The Orion server sent to a NLU, that is a artificial intelligence, the content. And if certain contents are sent, this is translated to FreeTag server. Frita server also calculate additional information and finally display into WinTech. And I will play HQ and I will be able to see what is going on at uh, yeah, on the field uh, by simply you know watching my screen. And uh, Greg is going to be able to simply speak in a radio. So the plot that today we want to play is that uh, the team represented by Greg is patrolling a zone when they get under fire. The team goes uh, for cover and concealment and a sniper is detected. Uh, successfully, a uh, team member is hit and then evacuated out of the kill zone. A uh, main evac is called and the team wins the firefight and finally they report to the events. And I will let uh, now Greg share his screen. So Greg will show you what is the Orion client on his side. Go on, Greg. All right. All right, so what I'm showing you on the screen now is the Orion push to talk client running on Android. So I would be using this device and this application as an, uh, someone operating out in the field. So I'm going to join my group. This is the group that the rest of my team is in. You'll see the rest of my team is online. And I'm going to make contact. Okay, let me show. Contact, contact, contact. Oh, you're right. Excuse let me share my screen first. So we are sharing now uh, WinTAC. And you can see that here we can see Greg location and we can also see that a contact has been created into attack. That is the first part of the demo. In the second part, uh, the sniper is located and we will use the DDD for uh, describe where it is and the distance. On. 100 meters northwest sniper. You can now see that the correct uh, military standard 2525C symbol has been created, not a 100 meter to northwest of Greg current position. And now a team member has been hit and we call a medevac uh, 100 meter to the north. Medevac requested 100 meters north. Uh, the uh, request has now been published to the server. You can see that it's appearing to the north, one on the meter. And now the team wins the combat and clear the alarm. Clear, clear, clear. Success. The alarm has been clear and maybe you have heard in the background that the system is reporting that has been accepted. And finally, the team will now report the situation with the SITREP. SITREP, 
We have been attacked by a sniper. Hostile has been neutralized. Mission continues. As you can see, the message has been now sent in the common chat or chat room of ATTAC. And uh, we have also sent a link to the correct audio file, just in case the message is not clear enough, so it's possible to download it. In a future version, we will send that in a data package. Now, talking about future version, that is for now the end of our demo, but future evolution include the ability to report a thread around me. So if you will say thread around me, you will get the message like hostile infantry approaching 300 meter west. Then we will also implement a dynamic thread that includes that if you are entering a zone in which an hostile infantry has been identified, you will get an audio message for that. You are also getting an automatic alert if a team is down like his team Bravo is not moving since one hour, he will be first contacted by the system, and if no answer is provided, then Platinum Delta will be contacted and informed about the condition of team Bravo. We will also support the salute report, and we are going to support routing in the sense of, if you say, we are now moving to Kandara, a route to Kandara will be created for team Bravo. So that is the conclusion of our demo. Thank you so much for your attention. And we'll see you next time.